it's been a few days since I posted um, but there hasn't really been a lot of progress I have still been working behind the scenes I've been researching and um, finding competitions I can enter and workshops that I might be able to get involved with um, ordering my tickets for the newborn photography show that's held at the NEC um, next month and um, completing my application form for university I just wanted to stop, drop on and just say hi and update you with what's going on um, and um, basically that's it really um, I'm still looking at pushing myself forward and um, trying to reach out to companies that might want to work with me um, for branding purposes or to take images of their products um, so that's basically where I'm at um, I still feel um, there's something holding me back with contacting companies and I think it's down to my own confidence um worrying that uh, why i worry about asking because all they ever can say is no um but it's just it's just there it's just blocking me but i need to try and move past that because i need to start working and believing that i'm a photographer um because i am a photographer <laughs> um so that's basically it. It's only a short and sweet video. Um, I haven't really got a lot on at the moment. I'm putting a portfolio together to complete my application for the university. Um, I'm entering competitions. I've got some workshops that are coming up that I'd like to um, get involved with. Um, and I'm researching products because a lot of my... Um, when I've done weddings in the past, um, I've been happy with the albums that I've provided and people have liked the albums that I've provided, but I would like to look at more luxury end. Um, so I'm looking at more um, professional albums and prints and acrylic prints and um, you know I'm just I'm just researching it all and noting it all down. Um, joining ver various um, community groups online. For female photographers like um, She Clicks Photography Community, um, for female photographers um, who run regular monthly challenges, um, which I thought um, will help me constantly be working with my camera. So that is um, basically where I'm at, and um, hopefully I, I can. The further I go on, the more updates I make. Um, the more progress you'll see. You have to ignore my hair today. I, I've just been on school and so just scrape it back. Yeah, so I had a massive coughing fit on the last chunk of the video, so this is why there's a bit of a cut. Um, so basically that's where I'm at. So I will continue to post videos um, to update you um, and hopefully they'll begin to make more progress I do feel sometimes that I'm putting working but not gaining a lot back or gaining a lot of <coughs> <coughs> progress done but I need to stop believing in myself I think and st stop seeing myself as a freelance photographer I'm self-employed um, there's just still all bits I need to sort, like insurances and tax. Um, but it's, it's exciting. I'm looking forward to um, starting properly. Oh, um, my studio as well. Um, cleared that out of any boxes that I had. So the only stuff that's in there now currently are, is my studio stuff that's ready to be set up. Um, looking at getting it painted um having the carpet ripped up and having flooring put down which will be easier to work with um out on the drive i'll have to do a video where i'll show you out on the drive we've got a massive um shed that was um left behind by previous owners so i'm turning that into a, a secondary studio uh, where i can do uh, more editorial fashion model type shoots um and then i'm hoping to keep the indoor studio for baby toddler children um 
although it, it is a decent cube space so um i'm hoping i can work with with most people in there if possible um but it's just about logistics really and making sure that it works with the space because it's not a massive space it'll work obviously i've got to get brackets on the wall for the the, the background drops and um somewhere of storing um props if i'm doing anything um, newborn boys although i have got a couple of cupboards that i can use to put that stuff away um and then i'm looking at whether or not i'd be able to bracket the lighting rather than have it on stands but I'd, it's all things that i'm trying to work out and research and figure out as i go along so that is where i'm at but um the studio is one of the things that i am keen to make a priority and get sorted because um I see all these photographers who advertise um, Easter shoots and Valentine's shoots and um, I want to be a part of that. I want to be able to offer that type of photography and um, change my background, set up like cute little scenes. So, yeah, so yes, that's where I'm at. Uh, so, uh, thanks for watching and I'll be in touch soon.